All right. Now, welcome everybody. Welcome Sagittarius. This is a general reading for Sagittarius. And I'm not going to time my videos. I have learned from other readers not to do so. So whenever this video finds you is when you are supposed to see it. Um, but I will tell you that we are in now Pluto, but a Mercury retrograde. And I am very, very excited. I have researched a lot of the spirits, uh, the full moons, um, the eclipses. Uh, I've done a lot of work on setting everything up for you guys where it's absolutely understandable for anybody that comes in. Um, but as I would say to everybody, um, this is a general reading, so take whatever resonates and leave what does not. And for all the cross watchers, and to check out your sun, moon, and rising, and your Venus. And we're going to start out, and let's see exactly what the spirit has for you today. All right. Ooh, hello. <laughs> all right, the magician, and the six of cups. Six of cups is, gener is uh, generosity, and. Actually, playfulness, like an innocent kind of happiness. So maybe you guys are actually, the magician is actually like a very powerful influence. And I would say you are actually learning how to be giving. Um, how to be happy by being with others. And the six is usually the hump over whatever that you've been going through all right spirit what else do we have the wheel of fortune yes giving like i was just saying uh you're going to be coming into some um uh, abundance that's actually abundance a changing of cycle uh, maybe you're going to be making a certain decision turning the wheel um i don't know if you guys have played the lottery <laughs> Uh, scratch offs maybe um, I'm not too sure but I'm gonna go ahead and clarify this magician for you magician is uh, holding a wand up in the air and pointing down to the ground so it's basically you have become grounded and learn how to be a little more giving a little more lenient um, and then on top of it like I said it was unexpected changes being decisive uh, changes cycles that's that's basically what I can I can tell you about the wheel of fortune but it is definitely abundance that's for that's for sure all right Spirit. why do we have the magician what is supposed to be learned here okay <laughs> all right I'm gonna take that top one because that's way too many cards that's like 80 cards all right, this is um, the Six of Wands. I actually did a video with, this is the card of the day, Six of Wands, which means praise, um, good job, celebrating an accomplishment, um, others actually seeing how good you're doing. So I think that really shows a lot of the Wheel of Fortune. Um, maybe you did complete... <laughs> A cycle by winning the lottery and somebody's like yay congratulations all right the moon um a little bit of confusion here on what to actually probably do with this abundance actually okay it's flipped all right yes and you're trying to stay grounded um you're trying to protect protect you're trying to protect uh what you have what you have um like here, you know, he's st he's standing on it and he's holding it. So, yeah, you're you're making sure that you don't lose it. So I really do think it has something to do with the lottery. <laughs> All right, the King of Swords. Oh, that is an actual mature um, person action. That's an action card. So this is a king that shows action um, that gives mature advice on how to act upon that. So you might be getting maybe an inheritance, maybe uh, some some kind of abundance here with the Wheel of Fortune. Um, people are at the bottom of the deck is actually um, 
wow, the seven of wands, which is actually being defensive. So you're being defensive. So you're actually defending um, your abundance. Um, wow. Okay. That's, that's explainable. So yes. So somebody here, either you or your person, or I'm, I'm pretty sure, I mean, this does feel like it's you, Sag. It really does. Um, yeah, I really don't have to clarify that, really. So it's all about abundance, inheritance, some kind of money. Uh, yeah, you're, you're kind of confused on, on where to go with it. But you're st if you're staying with it, you're holding it tight, you're holding on tight. Um, you've, you've definitely become um, uh, defensive, but this king is actually showing you the action to take with this, this abundance. And here, here's another one. Okay, this is like, you know, don't, don't thieve me, don't take from me. Making sure... Because you're kind of tired of holding this down on your own. So this is where the King of Swords actually comes in. This is not fucking Lordy. You've got to be kidding me. All right, I think that is about it. There's nothing else that I have been called to um, pull. But I will pull the angel message for you. Because, you know, you have, you, you're you going to be transforming. Whew, you're going to be doing a lot of transforming. All right, 44. I am supported, which is actually that king I was telling you about. Okay. Your angels are encouraged, encouraging you to continue on your present life path with diligence and deformation and even greater success will come in uh, the future. So you are supported. All right, Ted. So that is the reading for today. I hope it resonated. If it does, click that like button, please, and share. And actually, if you haven't subscribed... Subscribe to the channel. There's a lot going on. I actually have a raffle going on on June 3rd for a free reading. And it lasts maybe about 20 to 30 minutes. Um, and it's on the website. It is uh, spiritinsight.online. And you can also email me. And the details in the dis uh, description box below. And I also have a cash app for, hey, you want to buy me a coffee? You want to donate to the channel? That's much appreciated. I really do appreciate it. And I will shout you out on the channel. So you guys, thank you so much. I appreciate it. And you guys have a blessed day. And until next time, until next video, take care. Ciao for now.